Hello, I'm Dr. Michelle Murray, and I'm the President and CEO of Nexus Family Healing. Nexus Family Healing is actually located in four states. We are born and raised here in the wonderful state of Minnesota. We have services in the state of Illinois, in Maryland, and now in North Dakota. And we do some pivotal work. We provide residential treatment services for children and youth. We also provide adoption and foster care, outpatient therapy services and some in-home work and other community related services like crisis. And we serve children, youth and adults. Nexus's success is really based I think on a combination of many factors. One is vision, that the leaders throughout the history have had really great vision for the organization, and I mean all of our leaders, not just the CEO. We have an incredible group of staff that are extremely mission-driven. They are truly here to change people's lives. They know the impact that it has when even just one person can be in a better place and what that ripple effect is on families and communities, and it keeps our staff here and alive. And you just cannot do this work without that kind of dedication from our board of directors, through leadership, the agencies that we work with, and I wanna say our external partners. You know, we are really shifting this organization to work more in partnership with other community providers, and it's key to success. Hi, I'm Jolene Evenson, and I'm the Senior Director of the Nexus Foundation for Family Healing. My personal why for working at Nexus is the fact that there are kids and there are families that are hurting in our community. We might not always know how to stop that hurt, but we can play a role in their healing and in their recovery. I want to be part of that solution in whatever way I can and to provide people in our community that same opportunity and together we'll make a huge difference in their lives. COVID taught us so much and the biggest thing was that we can come together in partnership with the community, with our foster parents and make life uh, better for the children in our care. Hi, I'm Paul Zimmer. I'm a current board member of Nexus Family Healing and I'm the current board chair of Nexus Foundation for Family Healing. If I had a magic wand and I could ask for one thing from from our supporters and our community, I, I think the easy thing would be financial resources or money. Every nonprofit says um, no money, no mission, and, and it's true with Nexus as well. But I think more important, um, and what we're trying to build on, is develop a network of supporters and corporate partners that we can rely on because we know we can establish outcomes and we know we can make a case for support. And if we have that network that we can turn to for the support, then I know we can fund the initiatives that we need. For the next 50 years at Nexus Family Healing, what I think is gonna be critical is that we continue to work in partnership with other people in our communities to deliver the care that's needed. Because right now, what we're seeing in outcomes and success is that people need their whole person helped and wrapped and loved and cared for. You can't just treat one aspect of somebody's mental health. You need to look at their physical health. You need to look at their communities, their families. What are all of the things that a, a child, an adult, a family needs to really heal and be successful in life? So it's gonna be critical that we look at the partnerships that we're gonna need to have to help people heal.